啦啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Gold Pan with the Close Encounters DLC,、um, where we are working on our first star.、Um, it's going pretty well. It's going pretty well.、Um, uh, we, we've、uh, we've learnt the perils of、uh, not keeping on top of. Um, the aliens coming in that are infiltrating the hospital—they definitely do hold up the cues. Oh, we can hear one now that we need to、uh, look for. Is it you? Is it you, Frederick?、Um, we need to make sure that we keep them、uh, out of the hospital, as they are definitely causing problems. No, it, was it over here? Was it Zeke? Zeke? Is it you, boy? <laughs> Possibly one of the best names. <laughs> Someone. Who is it? Oh, it's running off the toilet. Is it Zeke? <laughs> I'm not seeing anything too suspicious. What's occurring? Maybe it wasn't. Mind you, we've not heard it since watching Zink, have we? The little sound. Well, we don't want to spend our entire time doing this. Getting himself a lovely mushus. Oh, I think she, she. That was yeah. Maybe maybe Zink's fine. Oh. We've got more over here. Oh, they're really coming in.、Um, so, what we would also like、uh, to do today、um, is I'm trying to also see this alien. I, I can hear them. It's frustrating. I want to get them out of here.、Um, is build some more of the、uh, cure clinics. That would be fantastic.、Uh, we are keen to. Get to five plots, right? And this one,、uh, marketing campaigns, is uh, uh, appeals to me right now. Oh look! So here, Gary Cosmic, fantastic name, fantastic face,、um, needs a DNA lab.、Um, we can't actually afford a DNA lab at the moment. They are sixty thousand, but I, I would really quite like.、Um, To build it, it's a powerful diagnostic tool as well as a treatment tool, you know. So it would be pretty cool to be able to build it. Although it might get a little bit overrun with the diagnostic side of things. Will we be able to afford to build it? Look, it looks like they're pulling cheesy gubbins out of the jumbo nuts. That's okay. That's okay. I think we can. We can、uh, deal with that. I, ha I haven't heard any more aliens for a little while. This needs repairing.、Um, do you know what? I might even upgrade it.、Um, so what's going on here? Yeah, the DNA lab. We're losing the money again. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. They'd like to learn any qualification.、Uh, Lauren Pye has a request for us. I'd really like to learn some new skills. I think I have untapped potential. Can I go on a training course? Okay, well there goes our DNA lab. It's Grunt, also known as the Henchman Phenomenon. A fault in the DNA has caused the sufferer's motivation to become straightforward and one-dimensional. They must undergo treatment before someone with the wrong idea takes advantage. Oh, it's it's fifty thousand. Hmm. Hmm. But now I need to do a training course. But now we can afford it. Oh, oh! What do we do? Right, I think we will go with the DNA lab.、Um, that's what we'll do. We'll go with the DNA lab. I think we will pop it over here. Yeah.、Uh, like, like this. Yeah.、Um, we'll get the fire extinguisher in. Very, very important. We can't afford much more, though. So let's make sure that we can at least cool the room.
Um, there we are. This is probably better near the door if you wanted to sort of min-max this sort of thing. You'd want this and this by the door so they can just come in and repair uh, without having to walk around the room. Um, but that's fine. Uh, patients can still come in when they're doing that sort of business anyway. Um, so we're going to need... Oh no. Do we have... Oh, I think we've got Lucky except we can't afford her. So not as Lucky. Quick. Overuses Basil. <laughs> we just need a little bit more doubloons, just a few more doubloons, and then um, we can get Henrietta Curious in um, to operate our DNA lab. It's a good money maker, the DNA lab. I'd really like. Come on. No! <laughs> no! I don't want to take out a loan. Don't make me. Don't make me. Um. Mm. Uh, what we're going to do is copy this Benny. No, we're not. Because I have no money. Maybe I will take out a loan. Uh, character creator. Um, oh, dear. Oh, dear. What do we do? What do we do, everybody? What do we do? <laughs> we have a queue forming. That's for Pan's lab. We're going to have to send them home for the moment. Come on, where's all the money? Is there... Let's send a bunch uh, for treatment out of here so that we can get some doubloons in. Fantastic. Anybody here that we can just uh, send for treatment? Excellent. Good. 62, sure. New from okay, just trying to send, push some people through. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, an emergency. That'll also help with some money, but she's tired. Oh, well. Ooh, but did you hear that? We've just unlocked a building. Which one was it? And what time fly? I thought I was unlocking somewhere over here. Oh, there it is. It's... <laughs> right next to it. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, um, I'm not sure we're going to be able to do this. No, we might have to send him home. That's a shame. That's a shame. Right there. Uh, we could send Bob Moose here as well for treatment. Um... They can go for treatment. Uh, Bob Moose can go for treatment. Hello, Bob Moose. Hello, hello, hello. We're struggling to earn the doubloons right now. We'll do this emergency. That will also help uh, get some doubloons in. So, uh, where are you? How are you doing? How are you doing? Excellent. Pretty good. Pretty good, I see. Good. Confidentious. Uh, unwanted knowledge of classified information has caused alarming levels of teeth gritting and tongue biting. Oh no, the teeth have become tense and dis... 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 dissociated <laughs> from the rest of the body. I do know the word. I, I'm just having trouble <laughs> uh, from the rest of the body and feel like an entirely separate, potentially detachable entity. The sufferer requires therapy to reacquaint themselves with their own mouth. <laughs> um, clearly, um, uh, I also need to be reacquainted with my own mouth. So, uh, electrical storms have been detected. It's a little bit of a concern. Uh, something worth doing when we get messages like this. It's just check on the machinery level. They're okay. They're okay. They're not too bad. Um, let's now accept this bovine emergency. Uh, we could really do. Could we could really do with getting uh, Denise Gold uh, in? Let's watch this again. I love this machine. The sounds, the leaning on it, just like it really is like a, a, a box packing. Here we go. Are you ready, everyone? 
no. Hey! <laughs> amazing. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. Oh, look at these two. <laughs> How's it going, guys? <laughs> How's it going? Uh, excellent. So how do they arrive? They they just must arrive in a car, because I don't... We've not seen any helipads. We don't get helicopters, it seems, out here. Um, so they just must be rolling up in taxis and whatnot. You know, like this. Not this is taxi, but it's a car, so it might... No, is it just going to drive on straight through? It is. Oh, oh, here's a taxi. Here's a taxi. There we go. Hello, welcome. Welcome. Pandora, fossil. Uh, still loving this car with the duck hood ornament. <laughs> um, oh no! One was abducted already! We must have killed them. We must have killed them. How could we? How could we? Oh, that's a point. Yeah, we are supposed to be... <laughs> Thanks, Spalding. Um, sorry, Crank. Excellent. Oh. Oh, did you see that? It totally froze. Right, uh, let's get that operational. And while we're here, who's in the queue? Let's uh, send a bunch of them for treatment right away. Um, because the queue built up a little bit over here. We need to build pest control. Um, okay, pest control. We're going to send them home because we need to gain a little bit of money first. But pest control... Um, is a thing. Something else that I'd like to do is accept this um, so that we can do marketing campaigns to get uh, more flat packed patients yes. rolling in. Um, I think that would be pretty super smashing great. Um, oh, we, we successfully treated this bovine patient. Um, I'd like to see if we kill any others so that we can um, watch as they are abducted. Uh, Who's this? What's happening here? He has allergies. Dominic Tingle has allergies. Potentially from re-entry. It's hard to say. Hard to say. Right. Is there some aliens over here? There is. I heard one. Because we've got a queue building up here, which seems a little bit ridiculous. Um. Right. Where is he? Where is the alien infiltrator? Oh! Imogen Dickens here. <laughs> We've definitely got more than one. And every time I take my eyes off the screen... Oh, they're definitely one. <gasps> this is this gets this gets uh, pretty tricky. I love that they they've still they genuinely seem to have the illness. They're just they're beyond curious, surely. Oh hello. Was that No, it wasn't over here. It wasn't over Oh <laughs> It was over here It was over here <laughs> Amazing Amazing. Right. Alien infiltrators. I know you're here. Oh. No. <laughs> Look. No. <laughs> no. They're all being abducted. We're doing a terrible job. We're doing a terrible job. I'm pretty sure there's some more alien infiltrators over here that we need to remove. Uh, we could definitely do with over here. That's still absolutely a thing. Now, we need animal magnetism. This is all nurse stuff, isn't it? And I think animal magnetism is nurse as well. 
Uh, pest control. It's nice, yeah. Hmm. Um, so may we could move this, I suppose. Patient has expired. That's terrible. Why am I laughing? <laughs> uh, send you for treatment. They actually have the diagnosis, so we'll move them to the top of the queue. I'm sure there was more of them in here. I'm not entirely sure. Ooh. Oh, they're nasty. That's a bit of a shame. Uh, but at the same time, um, I really need to get marketing uh, running. Wow, we've got a lot of deaths occurring uh, at the moment. Pretty sure our cure rate is fairly low. <laughs> Pandemic. Okay. So that one is definitely doctor. So what we'll do over here, I think, is see about doing some, some doctor treatment rooms. Um, and Pandemic seems like a good place uh, to start. Um, so let's do that. Um, let's pop this in. Uh, the doctor that will be in here uh, needs all the usual gubbins um, to make sure that they are fairly happy about working in this room. We're not going to make it beautiful, but we're at least going to try and deal with their needs, make them somewhat comfortable. That would be fantastic. Now, I'm not entirely sure if we have a treatment doctor uh, on staff. Uh, we've got this one. Do we have any better GPs at the moment? Perhaps one that we could train into a GP. Look, um, that could be great. Uh, so you could become a GP. Um, freeing this person up. Uh, to do, do you know what, if we toggle this on and then just turn these off, uh, that works for us. Um, there we go, so that we can get the pandemics going. Uh, what we could do, um, oh, she's just finishing off that bowine uh, one. Let's copy this staff room. Um, let's copy the staff room. We'll stick this over here and we'll copy the bog as well and we will stick that uh, over here um, fantastic okay so that's that's something that's a start on that um, something else I'd like uh, to do is get marketing in um, not entirely sure where to pop marketing maybe we will just stick it over here um, for the time being um, Let's do it. So it's going to be a facility. We can unlock, uh, we can unpause it. Uh, it's going to be a facility. So let's do this. Excellent. And build uh, a quick research room. Quick and cheap. That's what we're going to do. One that has some football yes. tactics, you know. Some football tactics. We definitely need a lava lamp. All the essentials. <laughs> All the essentials uh, in it goes so that we can start um, a media campaign an illness an illness one um, for flat packed just so that we can try and work on this if we could get more of them coming in um, that would be great we would uh, we would really like that you'd like me to train three staff we do have a training issue occurring here um, we should probably do that um, we already have Laura Pye here, who would, uh, Lauren Pye, who would like uh, to be treated. Uh, you know what I mean? Um, it might be worth getting... Oh, they're nasty. It might be worth getting them in, but no. Okay. Do we have more holding up cues over here? Possibly. Um, Has anyone actually read the ingredients list for brandy? It just says... Salt, 84%. <laughs> Other ingredients, 60%. <laughs> Think of sending some samples to the lab to find out what those I want those are. other ingredients there. You don't need a lab to know what's coming up. <laughs> Excellent. There's definitely an alien holding things up here, but I don't know where they are. Where are they? Oh, are you one? Quentin? You are. Okay. Good. There's another one, I think. Somewhere over here. Maintenance required. 
I'd like to build some more stuff. But at the same time, we can't let these uh, aliens infiltrate the hospital too much. Uh, do you know what I mean? It's it's not good. It's not good. They hold up the queues. They just sort of go around in circles, preventing others uh, from getting what they need. So I feel like there might be somebody over here. It's an alien infiltrator. Mm. Right, let's build, I'd like to build a training room. So we're going to, to do that. Uh, so a facility, not toilets, training room. There we go. Let's get that in. A couple of chairs um, to get them going. Let's, we'll pull this out and pop that there. Um, and actually get a larger one in here. Uh, that will that will do actually let's put um, some of these they do stack um, with their training uh, boosts so that's fantastic so first of all um, right Lauren would like some training so what we're going to do is actually uh, train her in injection administration because she's already working on the treatment track uh, so there's no reason that we can't keep her in the injection room but to uh, just make that a little bit better, we can increase her injection skills by 20% um, so that she's more specifically trained for that room. So I think that's what we'll do. Uh, we're going to have to get uh, Bernard Nightingale in uh, to train her in it, uh, which is absolutely fine. So let's do that. We can get that one done. Uh, I don't know if we'll do this. We'll do our best. Journalist for the Two Point Squabbler, Charlatine Fish Wrapper, recently um, bought new snooping gear and wants to test some of it out. If she's impressed with the hospital, uh, she'll think that the operation is going well. And we might even receive a bonus from the Two Point Squabbler. Well, I don't know how well we're doing, really. Um, <laughs> you know, I'm not, I'm not really sure how well it's going, um, but we'll see. Undercover journalist approaching the Undercover hospital. Undercover journalist approaching the hospital uh, let's see if we can help uh, what is this now a meteor shower has been detected let's just have a look um, at the repair levels of things um, uh, we could actually uh, look at some uh, upgrades couldn't we maybe this one might be nice so um, we're going to see everything uh, shake. I love this heat haze. This heat haze is amazing that we have down here. I love it. Charlatine's in the house. Is the earthquake going to happen? There it is. Just try and keep an eye on our machinery as it occurs. Oh, UFO's in. Uh, we're getting space rock plummeting to the hospital. Uh, that should be okay. I think we're okay. Look, Space Rock has landed. Presumably from space. Um, what has happened here? Does everyone just watch the puppet show and wet themselves? Hmm? Is that what's happening here? <laughs> it's disgusting. <laughs> Maybe we should hire another janitor has potential the potential you're going to have is to clean that up right definitely heard that definitely heard that where are you where are you oh that's looking a bit rough isn't it the space oh you get out of here get out of here <laughs> He does actually, though, look genuinely inflicted with animal magnetism. You know? <laughs> feel bad about it. Um, right, there's definitely more that we need to, to get out of here. We can hear you. 
Fantastic. She learned her qualification. Right. So that means we have 100 days to train two more members of staff. It means we kind of need to train two at the same time. Um, hmm. Hmm. Where do you work? Yeah. I can't really do that. I think janitors is going to be the safest uh, bet um, right now. Um, our janitors are a little bit all over the place. So what I'll do, I think we will d just do s some ghost capture training. Keep it simple. And we can actually get them to train it to save a little bit of money. Um, that's what we'll do. Yeah, it's a little bit it's a little bit weird. Our janitor situation is a bit, is a bit crazy. Right, I heard that. I heard it from all the way over there. Let's send you for treatment. And you. And you. Doctor to research, Doctor to research please. Where are the aliens? Where are the aliens? <laughs> I don't know. Is that marketing campaign still going on? It's almost completed. That's good. Because, uh, of course, we do want to bish bash bosh through these uh, flat packed uh, patients. There's another one coming here. Going to the self assembly room. Fantastic. Heading to self assembly. Do you know what? I, I also haven't seen if. Uh, I want to see the, the, the spongy cake balls they've been they've been updating um the snacks they pull out of these machines they're no longer all just sort of chocolate bars um so i wonder if the one that mentioned about the product jokingly being squashed into like a chocolate bar if if that one has been changed um or if it's the description that's been changed or if there's been an oversight there and they i, I don't know which machine it was should we find out let's find you out not that one your house. no it's going to be food that much we know Even your life. so that's why you need stocked like with briny brittle your weekly salt in one convenient <sighs> bar so we're assuming that a bar will still come out of here but i'm not sure it is it might be actually a packet now um. Oh, boom! It's on a stick. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, do you know I'm not seeing it? Maybe they did change the description. Um, or maybe I am thinking about this one where it's um been put into a convenient bar. Um, I've got a feeling these might be a packet now. Um, I'd like to see that that being used. Now that we've seen this being used, let's put in um, some drinks. We could probably put in the probability because, uh, oh, uh, you know, they don't they don't have the uh, the cure rate thing uh, issue occurring, do they? That's not really a thing. Oh, do you know what we haven't done? Do you know what we haven't done? In here, we've not checked out the specific items for this room and you know they probably have their own they do they have room specific things oh how could stationery barrel stores unwieldy novelty pens oh oh look it's amazing what's this a shredder well that's pretty terrifying exchange is uh, a thing for lots of smaller things is that what it does is that that's <laughs> fantastic. I wonder if they they don't seem to interact with it. There doesn't seem to be a standy spot for it. Doesn't seem to be a standy spot for it. What is this? A supply rack. Mm, stationery. <laughs> Look, it is absolutely a supply rack. Look at it. Look at pencils. Scissors. What do we suppose these are? These? Do you think these might be highlighter pens or those sticky bits, you know, for saving your place in pages? Oh. Oh, I want to see this work. Oh. Look. 
I can't believe I didn't do that. Look, should we just quickly? I mean, it's probably. We, we may have. Uh, no, that's the wrong filter. We may have potentially discovered. Uh, or, oops, oops, oops. Oh, so I edit that. I didn't mean to edit that. Um, uh, that are available. Uh, this is a uh, potentially a very tedious way of finding out <laughs> there's if there's any items we're missing but i must know <laughs> i must know but no we, I mean, we seem to be uh, fairly clear i checked uh, we've checked the staff room because um you know that's always a good one to be uh, checking for this sort of stuff the ward uh, possibly no? Okay. Uh, anything else in here? That still says staff room. I'm not. I'm not selecting the rooms. Egypt. <laughs> to be honest, all the items are probably uh, fine, aren't they? I think we probably have discovered what items are, be, are to be discovered uh, so far. I would imagine. Um, I think we probably have. So not to worry. I think at the moment we're, we're all good. Um, I still feel like, yeah, that we've got some alien infiltrators over here uh, giving us a bad time. It might be time to get another uh, receptionist. Don't know about you, but sort of looking a bit busy over here. Um, so maybe we could uh, help out uh, with that one. Uh, I do not want to be working in marketing. No, we don't. We have completed uh, a marketing uh, campaign. Uh, so, you know, we don't want to muck around. We still need the flat pack. So we, we, we might as well just uh, do that again, uh, just to keep that going. Um, you know, because with, with just two of these being completed, we'll have our first star um, in the new DLC, which I think is pretty, pretty exciting. You know, I think I think I'd be pretty pleased, uh, pretty pleased with that. But it won't be happening uh, in this episode. No, no, no. Uh, for we are out of time. But uh, it's it's all good. Oh, look at this horoscope discovered: an infection of the eye caused by dirty telescopes, binoculars, or space goggles. Sufferers predict upsetting events and see really off-putting things. <laughs> Brilliant, uh, absolutely brilliant. I don't know if that's a visual illness or not. Uh, let's, maybe we can have a look. Probably not. Probably not, no? Uh, patience. You. No, doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. It is just an infection of the eye, after all. Uh, indeed it is. <laughs> brilliant. Good. Well then going well i think for gold pan thank you for watching i hope you've enjoyed the episode if you did please hit that like button as long as you are here why not take your first step on the path to total coolness by supporting me via patreon the cooler you are the harder i work which means even more shizwa 